As you may know, the University of Michigan Stephen M. Roth School of Business is often spoken of as a top 10 business school among the American programs. It's a top general management program with strengths across disciplines. The school is based in Ann Arbor, a classic college town in the state of, you guessed it, Michigan. But here are three things you may not know about Roth's. First, unlike many other MBA programs, Roth doesn't have majors it truly places an emphasis on general management. However, you can elect a focused program in your area of professional interest. The options are the data and business analytics concentration, design thinking and innovation, the environmental, social and governance concentration, the healthcare management concentration, and the specialization in management science. The last one is STEM designated, an important feature for international students looking to extend their eligibility to work in the United States. Ahead of starting the program, Ross candidates who have a special interest in operations can apply to the Tauber Institute for Global Operations. Have a deep interest in finance? you can get to the selective fast track in finance to take electives in the subject early on. Additionally, if real estate is your thing, you can pursue a certification in real estate development. Finally, if your interests extend beyond business, you may be drawn to the Rackham Graduate School Certificate Program. These are offered in a number of diverse areas, including African studies, film, television, and media, and precision health. In any case, participating in one of these programs can help you dive deeper into your areas of interest and also signal them to future employers. Second, hands-on learning opportunities abound. You may be familiar with Ross's signature offering, MAP, or Multidisciplinary Action Project. This seven-week consulting project takes place at the end of the first year. Students work in teams of four to six to solve a real-world problem for a sponsor organization in the United States or abroad. It's like a mini internship, but what you may not know is that there are immersive opportunities at Ross well beyond MAP. For example, in the popular elective, Business leadership and changing times, students work in teams and put themselves in the shoes of executives who find themselves dealing with a crisis or are at an organizational crossroads. While role-playing the executives, teams present their plan of action to the class and field questions from members of the press and other stakeholders. Sometimes actual employees of the company attend. In the finance arena, Ross offers six student-run investment funds, including the Social Venture Fund and the Real Estate Fund, or if you have a passion for entrepreneurship, you can bring your concept to fruition in the Integrated Product Development course. Outside the classroom, you can partake in the offerings of the acclaimed Zell Lurie Institute. Options include the Tech Arb Student Accelerator and Michigan Business Challenge, which allow you to vet your idea and bring it to life. Or if you have a social impact net, you can join the Community Consulting Club. Through CCC, you and your teammates will solve a strategic challenge for a local nonprofit. In a similar vein, you can join the Business and Impact Board Fellows Program to shadow a nonprofit board. As a board fellow, you would contribute to the mission of the organization while gaining exposure to the governance process, ideal preparation for joining a nonprofit board someday. And there are international opportunities too. During short term global experiences in the spring or summer, students meet with company executives and scholars to gain deeper insight into a specific area of interest overseas, for example, manufacturing in Italy. Third, Ann Arbor can be a very fun place to live. While it's a college town and not a major city, it has many of the amenities you'd associate with a large urban area. For starters, you can enjoy music venues such as the Ark for folk music or the Blind Pig for a wider variety of tunes. The downtown also features art galleries, cafes, and eateries ranging from fast casual to high end. A couple of area restaurants such as Spencer have even been nominated for James Beard Awards. Just north of the Ross campus is Carytown. This neighborhood features a well-known farmer's market and even more restaurants its most famous offering, Zingerman's Delicatessen. This delicious spot, which has both a sit-down area and an extensive go-to-market, is regularly visited by swarms of people, especially on weekends, and they even ship around the world now. While you're standing in the long line to get a table, cheerful staff members may come by with free samples of mouth-watering sandwiches, brownies, and other local treats. One concern that some prospective rosters have is the weather. Michigan is not known for having warm winters. However, rest assured, it's possible to live close to the Ross building if you want, and a car is not a must for venturing away from campus either. Downtown Ann Arbor is only about a 15 minute walk from the school. 
If you're interested in applying to Michigan Ross, I encourage you to download our free insider's guide that will give you a great overview of Ross in terms of academics, culture, and community. If you have questions about your specific candidacy, please sign up with me or one of my colleagues in MBA Mission for our free 30-minute consultation. We can discuss how you can position yourself best to be a competitive applicant for Ross. Click the link below to sign up. Ready to apply to Michigan Ross? Watch the next video with our tips on how to get in.